Hello and welcome. This is a video I've been wanting to do for a long time. My Xbox 360 collection. So first you have Connect Adventures. I only have it because it came free with the Connect. It's the only Connect game I have and it's fine. Like I played it when I got it, that's it really. Next we have the first ever two games that I got for the Xbox. I got them with them, you know, the deal thing. And there's the two of them. It sort of came with um, the controller pack. It was this game and a controller. And I was only like seven when I got it. So, yeah. They're the ones. And then a game I got, well, I suppose about a year now since I got it. But I really wanted to get it. And it's Naughty Bear. Oh, sorry. Naughty Bear. And paid that much for it second hand. Is that good? Probably is good and probably good enough and it's a class game my friend had it so I wanted to get it and then we have it's probably about the second game I ever got for it uh, Need for Speed Undercover I probably paid too much for it because it was out like two years and I got it anyways but it was just the game that I seen so I bought it. and then we have one I'm gonna must have it about a year now last Christmas I got it when it came out. Modern Warfare three. And surprisingly enough I didn't really play it that much. But it, you know, everyone knows it's a class game. Um what the fuck is that? He's watching the mother. The mother. Complaining. That's Modern Warfare 3 anyways. Then next we have a game that I also got last year but it's not great. Uh, Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows part, part... Oh no, it must have been the year before, part 1. Uh, or the year before that maybe. And um, It's for the Kinect. And the Kinect bit is okay but like it hurts your arm, you know like that with the spells and all that shit and it's shit basically with the remote so it's shit then a class game that I'm not that good at but I actually like playing Gears of War the first one and I only got it for only 60 or on GameStop so I had to buy it like for 6 so that was a good buy anyways that's a good game and then the next one is Rage I only really started playing it most two or three months ago because I had it for a long time without playing it. I do that with some games, I don't know why. But um yeah it's good, like it's a good quad and then like you go to a town killing I'm not that good at the not that good at that much games. And then a game I got last Christmas and uh the best probably the second best game on the three sixty. Red Dead Redemption. But this is the game of the year edition which has Undead Nightmare and the normal one, the both of them. And it's class. It's class. Played it for like most of this year and last year, after I got it, like, I playing it for ages. And then you have, oh yeah, probably did the best 360 game. What sort of? GTA IV. Played this a lot. But not until about a couple of months ago. When I got this, Grand Theft Auto Episodes from Liberty City, which was released just after this, and has two games on it, The Lost and Damned and The Battle of the Gay Tony, but The Battle of the Gay Tony is the best Grand Theft Auto game so far, but obviously 5 is obviously going to beat it. Then we have a game I got a good while ago, about maybe two years ago, FIFA Street 3, and I actually... I. I don't really like football games but this looks cool and I actually nearly completed it and I'm always shit at the football games so that was that was a nice sort of a thing I, I got a good way through but then I, you know you just stop and then if you go back to it then good long time after you'll eventually you know do good and this game I didn't get it too long ago it's down to 989 I looked at it when it first came out and I really wanted it but I said, why would I bother paying 50 euro when it probably isn't that good? I got it for 9 there a couple of months ago. And, uh, 
haven't played much of it, but it's good enough. I like if you've seen it for nine ninety nine, I get it. Like get it. Like. And then the last game, the game I have the most recent bought, Modern Warfare Two, and that is Class Two as well. But it's not as good as Three. But the good thing is I don't have Xbox Live, so there's more things you can do in this than you can in Three. So. I'd actually play this more in the missions and whatever campaign is that the one you call it out from nine. A lot of people say it's shit, but it's actually good enough in this. So there is my 360 collection. Sue, so, uh, thank you for watching, and goodbye.